Hi everybody, welcome to another video from Lestats Gaming Live and today as you can see we are going to be playing Papers, Please, a new indie game that uh, is uh, actually getting uh, great reviews and uh, because of that I decided to try it also. So let's go to story. As you can see I have already played a uh, couple of times just to see what this was all about and um, let's go to day three so uh, the game in case you don't know it you are supposed to be well let's discuss it at the same time as uh, we play you work on a communist country and you are kind of a border patrol uh, in the case that you stand on this little box, I'm this guy coming in, and um, you have to click here. Oh, these are the rules for this day. The rules uh, of entry into your country change every day, and uh, today all foreigners require a valid entry ticket. So let's call in the first customer. Let's call them customers. Oh, I have to open this okay and this is uh, the entry visa and this is the entry ticket that is mandatory today and what you have to do is to check the data and see if it matches so this day is the current date so okay that's cool this date is uh, okay that means this entry visa is valid and uh, now I have to check if the on this country, uh, what's the country? Import. Let's see, yeah. On import, if there's an issuing city called Enkyo, and there is. So I think everything is okay with this girl, and I'm going to let her in. I'm going to give her the documents back, and uh, in she goes and you are paid uh, for your performance so you are supposed to be quick and I'm not being quick of course uh, because I am uh, talking and showing you what I'm doing and this guy didn't give gave me any ticket so I'm going to ask for it uh, oh no that's not how I do it okay uh, up. I have to go here and see the page where it says that all documents must be current. I think that's how I do it. No. Oh, uh, this is this option. Foreigners require an entry ticket. He's a foreign. He doesn't have an entry ticket. And now I got to interrogate him. Oh. He has the entry ticket, he just forgot uh, to show me. Uh, the date is valid, this is okay, and let's see then if uh, Obristran... Okay, I think everything is okay with this guy too, so let's give him the documents back and send them in. Next customer please. And as I said, you are paid for your performance. I can make you happy at any time. So this girl works for a strip club. Okay, I don't want that. Um, where she's from? In poor. I am. That's okay. So I think I can approve her too. A lot of yeses. I wanted to show you a no. And next, hmm, she looks different. Let's see if I can detect a discrepancy here. Yeah, let's interrogate. Hmm. She says that she has just changed. I don't know if I should let her in or no. This is okay. This is okay. 
Let's see the regional maps of the United Federation. Great Rapid is okay, but she's quite different. I'm going. To, I'm gonna say no. But that's kind of weird because people change. And if you uh, make a bad ruling, you get a, a warning uh, saying that uh, if you continue to make bad decisions, you will be fired and you will. This guy is from our country, so our country is called Artotska or something like that. So he doesn't need an entry ticket. Uh, this is valid and is male. Okay, everything is okay here. So, let's send him away and get the next one. I usually never detect the ones that are different, that they have different photographs. I always miss that. And uh, I can see the difference here straight away. This date and this date doesn't match. So, he can only enter tomorrow. Okay, let's refuse him. About the game itself, um, there's not a lot of variety of gameplay. As I said, the rules to enter the country um, change every day, so it's not a, uh, it's not boring on that regard. Um, so this guy is national, and uh, everything is okay with him. Just go away. Oh, the issuing, issuing city was wrong, so I got a warning. This guy is annoying. Uh, glory to Artroska, but he has no papers at all. So let's highlight that. Entrant must have a passport, and he showed me no passport. So it's time, people are going away, it's um, closing time, and uh, this guy is going to be turned away. Now, the difficulty in this is you are paid for your performance, and uh, as you can see, I got, uh, I had 10 uh, of money, there's no currency, but uh, let's call it money, uh, from the past day and I got 35 from today so I have enough to pay for rent for food but not enough to pay for eat and uh, soon my wife my son my mother-in-law and my uncle which all live with me by the way which is uh, freaking terrible uh, they are going to start suffering because I can't uh, bring enough food or uh, well I can bring enough money uh, to my home to buy them food or to um, buy them heat so let's sleep and go for the next day and here are we again on the checkpoint, ready for another day, and now I have uh, the indication that stricter credential requirements have been instituted and that uh, nationals still, uh, uh, I mean, nationals now have to show their ID card, which they didn't before, and uh, foreigners must secure and present a valid entry permit. Entry tickets are no longer sufficient, and uh, there's new rules on the rulebook. So let's test this. So as you can see, the complexity is increased every day. What is this? This is an entry permit, and let's r read the rules about entry permits. Must have a valid seal. This one has a valid seal, and that's about it. So, bearing passport number, and the passport number matches. The date is not expired, so that's great. Female, uh, Kalekia as an issuing city 
named West Greslin. It has. So I think everything is okay. As you can see, there's much more stuff to check this time around. And let's call the next customer in. You. How can I help you? Photograph matches, the date matches, the number on the passport doesn't match. Yeah, check again, like they are going to change. Okay, you go away. And, uh, next. Papers, please. You have a ticket. Tickets are no longer. Whoops. Foreigners require an entry permit. No, tickets are not enough. So, this guy would be okay yesterday. It's not okay today. And he calls bullshit. That's okay. Now, this guy, let's see. Everything seems okay here. He's going to immigrate forever. Okay, and let me just see if there's a. I am in. Import. There is. Oops, almost stamped it wrong. Okay, go away. So I quite vibe. Oh, the photograph didn't match. Damn. I didn't pay attention to that. Okay. This g gal is going to stay for six months. The numbers match. This. Oh, this is expired. Okay. This is expired, so. Your son is waiting, but uh, my family has to live, and um, they just arrest your family if you keep uh, failing. Your family and you, by the way, if you uh, start letting people in that shouldn't uh, go in. Well, what about the entrance must have a passport, so... What's... where's your passport? What? Can I use this? Well, it's from Artrovska. And it's issued by... Octavlis, so... Okay, the photograph seems okay, and it's valid, so... Now, this is the date of birth. Um... I've never seen this, so let's try it and see if I'm arrested. Yeah, I am. Last warning. <laughs> Things are going bad. The numbers match. This is valid, and uh, this too. She's female, so okay. <coughs> Let's see the geography part again. So, in Antegria, Glorian, I think that. This is okay, so let's give it back to her. And next customer, please. No, come on, invalid name. I was penal 
penalized in four credits, five credits. This guy again, this time a completely made up uh, passport. Oh, I forgot to stamp it. Denied. Even though it's clearly fake. Go away. Don't make me lose my time. I have a family to feed and keep warm. Artroska. Okay. Do the names match? Yes. Dates of birth match? Yes. Let's see the geography. See if it matches. Yes. So I think everything is okay here. Go away. So, the as you can see, this is. Uh, oh, come on! Well, things are getting difficult. Oh, so we are at time of the second day. D. Robin Fowler. Okay, number is okay. D. Dates. Are all okay? Let's just check if the United Federation has a Great Rapids in it, and it does. Uh, so what I was saying is that the game is fun, but it's uh, it gets repetitive. Even though the rules change, it gets. Oh, and I got another ticket! Unbelievable. Rent has gone up. And uh, yeah, I'm going to lose. So rent has gone up to. Well, actually, what's going to kill me is the penalties. Uh, 20 in penalties because I failed so much. It's uh, a little hard to be talking and playing at the same time. I got uh, only 30. Uh, I mean, I got 25 from this day and I had 5 left from yesterday. But with the penalties, uh, there's no way I can pay for my rent and my food and my eat so I'm going to be left with minus 10 and that means that I'm going to lose let's just look at that yeah my family is going back to the village and I am going to jail until they pay for my debts And someone else took my job, glory to Artotska. I think that's how you say this. What I was saying is that even though the rules change every day, uh, it's um, it gets kind of repetitive um, because and. Um, we only played two levels, so you, there's no way you can see this, but if I were to replay these two levels again, uh, the guys that would visit the boot would be exactly the same. So if I just um, make a note of first guy goes in, first guy goes in, uh, I mean first guy goes in, second guy goes in, third guy doesn't go in and so on, I would know uh, exactly what I would get the next time I would replay a level and uh, well that kind of takes the fun away from it. It would be uh, much cooler if... Um, that's just uh, kill the music. It would be much cooler if um, you could just get random people visiting your boot instead of what you get now uh, because um, well, this way you can just uh, memorize the outcome of every guy and uh, that way you will be able to, well, do much better. Um, but uh, the game is fun enough and uh, I've played it uh, uh, a little bit and I'm going to keep playing it. Um, Anyway guys, thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe on YouTube to get uh, warnings about new videos and uh, also follow me on Facebook and on Twitter and visit the website. Thank you guys, bye!
Thank you.